my next two attacks are going to be like hitting a beast body instead of a plant body and i have two very high damage bird cards to do that with what's going on my axie fam elijah here back with another video today i have a very important one for anyone who is getting back into classic and it's how to use artifacts now this is one of the newest game mechanics that makes a really big difference on how far you can go in the ladder and it's a key reason why serious players buy a premium pass pretty much every single season a premium pass costs five thousand gems which you can get for spending $30 in the store, you'll have 3,000 plus a bonus 3,000. It will unlock all of these artifacts for you to use, which allows you to play more games and have them as a resource. It'll also give you more rewards along the way, more AXS and SLP, which basically makes the pass pay for itself as long as you keep climbing up the ranks. And I just want to say that my creator code, Elijah, is now live. So if you haven't bought a premium pass yet, just enter this in the shop before doing so. Even if you don't buy one, you can enter my code and it actually helps the channel and if we do well I'll do a giveaway at the end of the season so without further ado let's jump into the content this game right here is just an example that Thunder and I did to show you the basics of artifacts you can see on my plant that he just played his beast artifact you get to play one artifact per game now some interesting things are once he plays it I will have a chance to counter it custom games are actually a little buggy right now the person who does the challenge is the only one who can equip an artifact at the moment but normally I would be able to counter this by playing a plant artifact which everyone gets played second takes precedent so I could turn this back into a plant which would prevent me from taking a truckload of damage but since I can't do that I wanted to at least show you guys the raw damage that's possible since he has a level 3 artifact I am converted for four turns now a turn just means whenever a card interacts with this axie in this situation thunder's just gonna play aqua cards so you can see how brutal this this actually can be and also remember clamshell gives you attack up when you hit a beast or bug target one other thing to note is you can see that I've already hit end turn here so technically I shouldn't be allowed to do anything but when an artifact gets played it actually reopens the option for the person that it got cast on to change either their cards that they want to play or to play an artifact of their own so you can see that as soon as he casts this on my plant my end turn will pop back up giving me time to to readjust if the clock is about to run out let's say there's like two seconds left before the turn is over and they try to just cast it on you you will be given 10 more seconds to readjust your cards or to cast a counter artifact if that's what you want to do we're going to see here that he comes with the double clamshell 155 186 in three cards he didn't even need the fourth one he completely wiped out a plant body and that is the power of artifacts in this scenario we made it so thunder doesn't use his aqua cards and you'll see that if that were to happen then it's the first four cards that my axie plays instead and each one of these makes the charge go away I actually do a little bonus damage there from being a beast and this is an important point because essentially if you're playing something like a beast or bug artifact you generally want fast axes so that you can be the first one to attack and be aggressive and get that damage in so far for me I've only reached level two on most of mine I can upgrade to level two but I usually use a beast or bug artifact considering I play a lot of aqua bird damage but guys level two it transforms axes for two cards when you get to level three it turns into four turns or four cards which we just saw in the thunder example he has a level three artifact which is so so strong the way you upgrade to level three is you will unlock this progression bar by opening chests for instance or winning cursed coliseum games these will also reward you with chests and you can collect more pieces of an artifact to get up to that next level three also these will carry over into the following season you won't lose your level so for instance people who have been buying premium passes they have a head start in accumulating and it allows them to upgrade to level three faster another reason why you want to go ahead and get one as soon as possible so in this match we can see things are actually pretty close here. You can say I'm at a disadvantage potentially with how much shield this midline plant can put up and how weak my dawn is. You'll notice that I played my artifact here on the plant, essentially making it a beast. And this is important because you can see that both my bird and dawn are faster than the plant. So I know that my next two attacks are gonna be like hitting a beast body instead of a plant body. And I have two very high damage bird cards to do that with. And we can see how this is just enough to put this Axie into last in a situation where if I didn't have these, 
it most likely would have survived even with 80 shield because I wouldn't be hitting for 162. I'd be hitting for more like one, I think 19 when attacking into a plant and bang, just like that, we take out the biggest threat to us here. We play an eggshell, works out perfectly. Damage goes to the bird and now we're in a 2v1 situation and save up for an easy four card combination and that's GG. I will most likely make more content on the subject because of how new it is. But I want to point out here that I did a stream yesterday where there was a lot of examples. We can see here I'm in a 1v1 versus a plant and I'm about to use an artifact. My first two cards will be bird damage on a beast body and then I switch to the hair dagger. I know that after that it will be a plant again and I want the damage to hit the plant body. So this is again one of those situations where I just guarantee the win by using the artifact. So leave a comment below. Let me know what you guys want to see next. I hope this video helps you. Love you guys. More classic content soon. Catch you in the next video. Peace.